Hey researchers, struggling to choose between Zotero and Cetavi for managing your references? Let's break it down fast. First, Zotero. It's a free open source tool that's super user friendly. Zotero shines at collecting and organizing references from the web with its browser extension. It syncs across devices, supports over 9,000 citation styles, and has a built-in PDF reader for annotations. Perfect for students or anyone on a budget. It's available on Windows, Mac OS, Linux, and iOS, but its mobile app is limited and syncing can occasionally glitch. Now, Cetavi. This is a powerful paid tool, free with some university licenses. Cetavi goes beyond references, offering robust knowledge management, like task planning and categorizing notes. It supports over over 10,000 citation styles integrate seamlessly with Word and allow seam collaboration with server storage options. It's mainly for Windows with a less feature-rich web version for Mac and Linux. The downside, it's complex and costly without a license. So, how do they stack up? Zotero is simple, free, and great for individual researchers who need cross-platform flexibility. Cetavi is feature-packed, ideal for teams or complex projects, but is pricier and Windows-focused. Check out this chart. Zotero, free, open source, basic collaboration, cross-platform. Cetavi, paid, advanced knowledge tools, team oriented and Windows-centric. Choose Zotero for affordability and simplicity, and Cetavi for in-depth research and collaboration. That's it, guys. Pick Zotero for budget-friendly research or Cetavi for heavy-duty projects. Drop your choice in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one.